Hey everyone, it's Luke here from Avtera Motors Battery Team. I just wanted to let you know we recently achieved a milestone. We're finishing up our production intent battery design for our launch vehicles. These vehicles are gonna have a 41 kilowatt hour battery pack. And I wanted to take you through some of the technologies and have you hear from some of the people who are enabling this to happen. So first, you might wonder how we determined how large of a battery pack we need for our design for Aptera. Our production vehicles will ship with six battery modules, just like this behind me, linked together with our patent pending bus bar design. We have 2,496 cells in the whole pack, 416 cells per module, and 41 kilowatt hours of usable energy. Hello, my name is Ahmed and I'm a battery systems engineer. So Aptera's battery pack is unique in that it is uh, a lot slimmer than most other battery packs. Our main design ethos for our pack was efficiency. The pack consists of six modules and the power distribution unit. Usually those are separate things, but in our vehicle, for the sake of efficiency and space, uh, we like to put those things together. Hi, I'm Daniel. I'm Aptera's battery integration engineer. I make sure that everything that's happening in the virtual world is working out when we do our prototyping. I think one of the more exciting next steps uh, with the battery is to see how the solar uh, charging integrates into our battery pack, because that's what makes it so special. So my name is Ryan Kaxinat. I am the lead DRE, uh, design release engineer for the battery pack and battery team. I'm going to be working on uh, releasing all of the parts for production, the whole pack for production. The design has been stripped down of all of the unnecessary uh, components and we're delivering the subsystems that will make it the most efficient pack in the market and at the same time uh, will perform for long-term durability. My name is Scott and I'm the lead battery test engineer. There is cooling and uh, electrical connections and many parts, mechanical parts that we've taken a slightly different approach to, to how it goes together and assembles. Um, and we're constantly improving that uh, for um, a mass production. I'm Tom, I'm a design engineer on the battery team at Aptera. Yeah, my main work for the past couple months at least has been uh, these cell carrier parts in the, you see in the back. Those are going to be injection molded. These are uh, 3D printed prototypes in the back. And so the design has evolved quite a bit over time to uh, account for mold flow and uh, creating a large, you know, dimensionally stable part that, uh, you know, is lightweight, is thin, getting a design that uses as little material as possible. My name is Diego and I am a battery frame design engineer. Recently, we have been able to finally procure and prototype with our production intent modules, and we also have a production intent battery frame uh, on the way, so. So next comes validation, certification, and everything that's required before you can legally sell it on the road. As far as certification, that includes lots of charging and discharging of batteries, some safety components of testing, uh, we need to make sure they're certified to be able to ship around the United States. And we need to make sure that everything in the battery pack is sourceable and works well together. So for our 41 kilowatt hour battery pack, we approached it from an efficiency first perspective. Um, so we're trying to get the least amount of weight possible, the most amount of energy while still being safe and cost efficient. We have 20% more energy density at the pack level than some leading brands that you might know. One way we can show you how efficient we are is by comparing to a gas vehicle. Now, for our vehicle, the ba our battery pack is equivalent to 1.2 gallons of gasoline. So imagine going to the pump and filling up 1.2 gallons in your vehicle and then traveling 400 miles. It's, it's pretty mind blowing, right? And we think this technology is gonna take us pretty far. Our entire team is super excited to build some of the most efficient energy dense battery packs in the EV space. And we are looking forward to starting limited production later this year. Thanks for watching.